What's up everybody, Dark Ghoul here, back again with another pack opening video. But before we start this video, I just want to say, if your name is on this screen right now, you are one of the winners for the Roaring Skies code cards. There's going to be six winners, and each winner will receive five Roaring Skies codes. So if you are one of the winners on the screen, please go ahead and contact me through YouTube. You can message me through YouTube, or you can email me at my email which will be in the description down below anyways now that we got that out of the way we still got another free code fridays coming up very soon it's not free code fridays anymore it's just a random code that i'm gonna throw out there well codes because it's gonna be more than one uh but i'm just gonna start throwing them randomly throughout the days throughout the weeks and stuff like that anyways let's get right into the main attraction which is this Break Evolution Box of Ho-Oh and Lugia. I know I opened one of these already. However, this one has a slight... Let's see, how should we call it? A slight mistake. So, this one is basically a mispackaged Ho-Oh Break Evolution Box. However, the mispackage isn't in my favor, unfortunately. Let me show you what I mean by that. All right, so as you can see, this Ho-Oh box has four booster packs, right? And you see on top of the Ho-Oh, there's a missing space. That's where the fifth booster pack is supposed to be. So either the pack fell out or it wasn't included. Therefore, making it a mispackaged Break Evolution box. So let's just get right into this thing and solve the mystery, shall we? All right, guys, so I already see it down here. So let's just get all the contents out of this box and let's see what we get, shall we? All right, y'all, so here we are with the giant Ho-Oh break card. We're just gonna go through these promos very quickly because if we did already view them in our last Ho-Oh and Lugia break evolution box. So I'll just do a quick little glance at these beautiful cards. I am so glad to get a second copy of these cards because they are just amazing. Except this one right here. If I can rip this one, I would. Anyways, I'll sleeve these up after the video. And let's just get into our five booster packs that we got for this video. Um, so we did, we did get all five booster packs, which is pretty cool because I was not hoping to open up four. I was hoping to open up five and this one just dropped in the bottom of the box. Anyways, let's go in order from Ancient Origins last, Breakpoint, Fates Collide, Fates Collide, and Breakthrough. It's mainly because this set doesn't contain any Ho-Ohs or Lugia, just like I said in my previous video. I said the exact same thing. Oh, and we also get a code for this box for the online tcg and i'll be throwing that into our free codes whatever day that's what we're gonna call it now free codes whatever day anyways let's get right into this opening shall we and we got a haunter a glalie spirit link cacturn a flabebe and we got a braviary regular rare jeez let's go into our first fates collide pack can we get a lugia Please, can we get a Lugia, please? Let us see what we shall pull. We got a Binacle, Ryolu, Mencino, or Mencino, whatever you guys want to call him. I like to call him Mencino because, ooh, a Dome Fossil Kabuto, Altaria Spiritling, Pokemon Fan Club. We got a line of trainers right there. We got a Fennekin Reverse. And then we got an Aerodactyl Regular Rare. That is a pretty dope card right there, to be honest. That artwork is pretty, pretty dope right there. So we're down to three packs. We're going to go into... Let's do an Ancient Origins. I don't know. I'm not really feeling this set. Just because it's out of print doesn't mean it really deserves much attention, to be honest. But let's see what we pull from here. I swear if we pull something good, I take everything I said back, Ancient Origins. I promise. We got an Oddish, we got an Eevee looking pretty cute right there. We got a Cottony, cute as well. We got a Relicant with the homies, you know, squad, turn up, turn up. I don't know what just happened there, but I don't know, guys. I don't know. We got, a, ooh, we got a Registeel Reverse Rare. That is a nice card right there, for sure. And then we got a Gyarados Regular Rare. Now, this Gyarados is in one of the tins for the, I think it's the Champion tins. We're going to go ahead and sleeve up our boy Registeel real quick. 
put him up there with the homies, you know, the new squad. Registeel, welcome to the squad. Anyways, let's go into our second Fates Collide pack and see if we can pull an EX or something. Come on. We need something, not just a Registeel. Alright, y'all. We got a Jigglypuff. We got a Fennekin. Snubble. We got a Seal. Bronzor. We got a Kabuto. Omanyte. Oh, we got the Fossils from Kanto coming up right there. And we got an Aerodactyl as well, so that completes the set. And we got a Meowth Reverse, and I see something back there because you can see from the black border right there. And then our rare is a g Ooh, man. Yo, that card is so dope, especially because this is one of my favorite. This is my favorite evolution. We got a Glaceon EX Full Art. I think in our last one, we pulled a Espeon Full Art. If I'm, correct me if I'm wrong. I'm going to have to rewatch that video, but yo, 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 that is dope right there. Let's go into Breakpoint. I want to get a Ho-Oh card from here real, real bad, but we'll see. We got a green code, so that's not good. That's not good. That is not good. All right, y'all, we got a Staryu, the loner, with no homies, if this wants to focus real quick. We got an Esper. Oh, it looks like a little baby right there. Just scratch. Really? Just scratch? We got a Pharaoh Seed. We got an Electabuzz. I remember him from a show, like always screaming, or her, him or her, whatever you want to call it, since Pokemon can be both genders, the majority of them. We got a Bursting Balloon. What is that? I've never seen this before. Looks interesting, but deadly. Ooh, we got a Rada Reverse with the squad right there. Yo, that is a dope card right there. I love Rada so much. I have uh, Rada. Rattata, Rattata, whatever you guys want to call him. Rattata is what most people call him, I believe. But anyways, I have him in for my Sun and Moon team. I have the Alolan Rattacate currently as my main guy. I kicked out my starter. Don't ask why. I always do that. It's just kind of a thing that I've always done. Anyways, let's get into our last card. We've got a Pangoro regular rare. Thanks, Pangoro, for ruining the vibe right there. We're going to sleeve up our boy Rata because... Rata, Rattata, like I said, people call them different ways. Well, I probably most people call him Rattata, but I don't know. I got, I kind of got used to calling him Rata when I was younger, and it kind of just stuck on me. But I sometimes say Rattata, I sometimes say Rata. You know, it really varies when it comes down to Pokemon. Anyways, for our pools, we got. Let's put Rattata back there because he's not really a pool. <laughs> he's just a reverse common. But we got a. Glaceon Full Art EX. We got a Registeel Reverse Rare. We got a Wobbuffet Break, a Ho-Oh Break, a Ho-Oh Promo, and then a Lugia Promo as well as our giant Ho-Oh Break right there. So right off the bat, all these shiny, shiny cards looking really, really dope right here. Really dope pulls. Promos, great addition. If you don't pull anything, you still get two breaks and two foils right there. And then everything else is just basically an extra. So without further ado, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.